Yes, that's a song called I Hung My Head by Johnny Cash. Actually, it was written by Sting, believe it or not. If you look up his version, you will find it's drastically different than what Johnny Cash did with it. But I really like what Cash did with this one. It's a strummer for you beginners. So it's something that we can uh, we can study and learn some intermediate strum patterns, but some fairly basic chords here. The F may give you guys a little bit of trouble, but other than that, it's a fairly easy song to play. So the chords that are gonna be in it are the C chord, which is your open first string and third string, first fret on the second string, second fret on the fourth, and third fret on the fifth string. Not gonna play the sixth string on the C. The F chord, I'm actually thumbing it. That means I'm bringing my thumb over the top to hold down the first fret of the sixth string. I like to play the F that way a lot when I'm playing it within the context of a lot of open chords. In other words, chords that are not bar chords. Uh, so the way I'm doing that, my first finger is holding down the first and second strings first fret. Thumb's gonna hold down the sixth string third at the first fret. And my middle finger is the second fret of the third string. And of course my ring and little fingers are holding down the third fret of the fourth and fifth strings. Now, if you find that difficult to play that way, you can bring your thumb around to the back of the neck and lay your bar finger down, your first finger, and bar all six strings at the first fret. I don't like to play it that way, but you can play it that way if you like. And it gives you the same effect. It's called an F chord. And then we're going to be using a couple other chords in here. A minor, which is going to be the open fifth string, the open first string, first fret of the second string, second fret of both the third and fourth strings. That's our A minor chord. And for the first section of the song, those are the only chords that we're going to be using. So we're using a C and an F and an A minor. Now the intro to this song has a little bit of a complex strumming pattern. I do have a tablature available for this over at guitarnimal.com. So I do, rec or do recommend that you guys go over there and take a look at that, download the tab. It is a members only feature, but hey, you guys can check us out for a week for free. So you'll be able to take a look at that. After that, the song falls into a more basic pattern for the verse. So the intro piece, a little bit more complicated. Going through the C, And all down strums on that on the quarters and the eights up and then F Put a couple sixteenth notes in there just on that back and forth strum and C F and then start to mellow out C open C so again the intro to this song is a little bit tricky I do recommend taking a look at the tablature for it once we get into the verse a little bit easier, the strum pattern for the verse is gonna be starting on a C, just down, down, up, down, up. That last strum, again, open strings on the second, third, fourth, and fifth string as a breath chord. Gives you a little bit more time to go to the, reg the rest of the chords. So C. F. Now the F strum there is gonna be a down, down, up, up, it's a little bit complex there, but not too bad. So of those four chords, three of them have the strum pattern down, down, up, down, up. And the last up is off the chord. So on the C. All right, so one more time, slow the verse. get more parts to this song at guitaranimal.com so make sure you head over there and check us out uh, we've got a lot of nice things for you to check out beside this song uh, again this is I Hung My Head by Johnny Cash hope you're enjoying the song my name is Trent <laughs>